A dye spill that caused a backup on Interstate 85 yesterday and left the road crazy colors could have some lasting impact for Spartanburg County. 7 News' Henry Coburn has the details. Spartanburg County Emergency Management says that dye from I-85 could spill into here, the North Tiger River in Spartanburg County. But they say there is good news. You don't need to be concerned. This was the scene on I-85 southbound Tuesday. Emergency management says a suburban was carrying a drum of blue dye in a U-Haul trailer that came off the trailer hitch while in motion. <laughs> Nobody was injured in the crash, but now the interstate is the color of blue jeans. Emergency management says that's because the dye that covered the road, spattered cars, and seeped into the river was on its way to Georgia to be used to dye blue jeans blue. Hazmat teams double checked that it was non toxic, and the local water authority made sure it didn't impact water quality or safety for wildlife. And even if you were one of those drivers who went through it, officials say you don't need to be too worried. Some people were worried they got it on their cars, but, uh, you know, I, I've, I've seen some posts on social media where people took their cars to a pressure washer or got home and you know, put a little elbow grease and uh, soap and water and it came right off. Now again, emergency management says this problem should clear up in the next several days. It shouldn't be long lasting whatsoever. But if you have any questions or concerns, you are encouraged to reach out to emergency management. For now in the North Tiger River, Henry Coburn, 7 News.